babes welcome back to the channel i'm really excited right now because in what's today wednesday three days i am going to florida for 10 days with james and i am so excited i've never ever been to florida okay we are taking a little road trip it's spring break and we're just gonna live it up kind of just travel around and see the state i do not want to be pale when I'm going down to the sunshine state, okay? Because if I'm down there vampire status, I'm gonna just melt away. So I'm really excited because today I am trying a brand new self tanner and it's from the brand Tan Cuticles. So huge thank you to Tan Cuticles for sponsoring today's video. I am a huge like advocate of self tanning because I try to stay away from those tanning boots. Girl, those UV rays are a big no, no. I'm not about that life. You know, you gotta take care of your skin a little bit. What I like about them, when I was doing my research, are the ingredients, okay? If I'm putting something on my body, I want it to be as natural as can be. I want it to be healthy for my skin, girl, you know? Cause you gotta keep your skin nice. It's a cruelty-free brand, and I take that seriously. That's good. So it is a CC self-tanner, so a color and correct, which is awesome. I've never ever tried anything like this before. This is in the color dark, just so you know. I have a self-tanning face lotion. I've never actually tried a brand that had its own face lotion, so that's awesome, because I'm always hesitant on putting the self-tanner on my face, but I really do like that this is designated for your face. And then I have the tanning mitt, because you need that mitt, okay? You need it. When I first started self tanning, I didn't use a mitt and uh, it's a hot mess. You want a mitt for like a nice smooth application. These are all sold separately, um, but they are very inexpensive. So just the self tanner alone, I believe is like $27. Very inexpensive compared to other ones. I'm gonna take you through step by step, apply everything, give a full review, show you, you know, how everything is looking. So I hope you guys tag along. So this is actually really super easy to use. Um, like most self tanners, it does advise you to exfoliate your body, kind of smooth out your skin, take all the dead skin cells off so that it can adhere to your skin better and it doesn't show patching or anything like that. So that's exactly what I'm going to do first. I'm gonna hop in the shower right now, scrub my whole body, even my face. I gotta exfoliate my face so that I can wear the face tanner. I'm so excited for this right now, yay! And then once you're completely dry, just lightly apply product to skin using a circular motion to the areas you want tan. For drier areas like your elbows, knees, hands, and feet, use very sparingly. Oh, that's nice. Very light coconut smell, like a creamy coconut. Why am I so weird, Ash? Just, just say coconut. No, I'm gonna say it's creamy coconut because I smell like some cream in there. It smells milky. Let me go into the shower, scrub my body, and I'll be right back. Okay, woo woo! I'm back, I'm back. I'm fresh out of the shower, just exfoliated. I think I'm gonna try the face lotion first. I'm just like dying to try it. I'm gonna put a little dab. I don't really need a lot because it's just for my face. Little dab on here. This is what it looks like. It's just kind of like a milky white color. Just like regular lotion, honestly. Rub it into my face. Mmm, that is a nice coconut smell. Both for this and the body, you do have to wait about seven to eight hours um, for it to fully develop. So it does say on the bottle that you shouldn't be sweating during that time, showering, anything like that. I do say it is best if you do it overnight. You can sleep in this lotion, so. From the looks of this, obviously, guys, it's evident that this is not a um, color guide kind of self-tanner. And by that, I mean it doesn't just have the color and you just smear it onto your skin. There's other self-tanners out there where you can see the color on your mitt, and as you put it on, it shows the color. It is a lotion base, so it is hydrating your skin. Because I notice that when I use some self-tanners, I will use it and it dries out my skin because I, I like didn't get to lotion up my skin. So this kind of does that for me. This is still like a light color, the body lotion, but it's got almost like a light, light tan color to it. So, let's go. Ooh, there we go. See, this is what it looked like. 
Do not mind my hairy arms, okay? I know. Disgusting. So I'm just gonna go ahead and just do the whole body, baby. I'm all tanned up. Feeling pretty good, feeling pretty hydrated. I am going to wait out the eight hours. Um, I got nothing going on tonight as it is. Um, eight hours from now will be 1 a.m. And I'm not washing it at 1 a.m. I'm not getting up to wash it off. So I am gonna sleep on this tan and then I will film tomorrow morning and let you guys know, see how everything turned out. I'm excited. Tan me up, baby. Get me tan. Woo woo, yeah, baby. Who this? Who this? Oh yes, absolutely, absolutely right now. Woo woo! Florida ready, baby. Yeah. This is the final tan right here. I love it. Perfect golden glow. I woke up this morning, I took a look in the mirror, zero streaking. I mean, zero streaking. I showered off and nothing came off of me. I didn't see like a running stream of tan down in the bathtub, you know what I mean? Okay guys, so I'm gonna just briefly describe to you guys my experience using this product. Y'all already saw the application process. I am not going to lie. I thought because there was no color guide, I couldn't see the color actually going on in my skin. I really did assume, honest to God, that I would wake up in the morning and it would be extremely streaky. However, thank God that was not the case at all. Everything was smooth. I mean, look, there is, there's no streak whatsoever on me right now. None, no streaks. It really felt like I was just putting lotion on my skin, like normal lotion that's just moisturizing my skin. Bay complimented me a ton. He's even thinking about trying it for himself before we leave. So I might be um, might be using this stuff on him. Uh, he needs to get a little bit of that tan going. He's pretty pasty. It is for men or women. So you could share it with your significant other. That's probably what I'm gonna end up doing. Honest to God, every time I try a new product I love, I swear he ends up using it, but hey, Sharing is caring, right? Absolutely love. I got no complaints right now at all. My skin does not feel dry. The color did not come off on my sheets or my pillows. Um, and even after the shower, I do use a white towel and it didn't even come off on that. So this is a gem. I love it. I'm sold on it. Two thumbs up. And also I do want to note that one of, the, one of the very first things I checked when I woke up in the mirror was my face because I'm just, you know, a skincare advocate. I wanted to make sure this didn't make me break out. There were no new pimples overnight, so yes. I will absolutely insert a before and after picture so you can see the difference. I absolutely love the color. I just want to say it's not orange. It doesn't have like that, that weird Oompa Loompa look to it. It's got like a nice, just a rich golden brown sun-kissed glow and I love it. They do say the tan lasts about up to a week. You can reapply this during the week as needed. If you feel like it's fading, you can just reapply it and it doesn't take long to dry. I was like dry within 30 seconds. Threw on my sleepwear, went to bed. I like the process of this. I like that there's no, um, it doesn't go on like brown right away and then just smear off on your clothes. I like that this goes on as a clear lotion and just like slowly develops over time. I can roll with that. That is my full review on the Tan Cuticles Self Tanning CC Cream. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you're looking for a self tanner for your spring break or an upcoming vacation or summertime, then this is definitely something to look into. I will have all of the links down below. Again, thank you so much to Tan Cuticles for sponsoring and collaborating with me on this video. I truly had a blast and I am without a doubt a new fan. So if you liked this video or found it helpful, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.